The first threat to Kenya's territorial integrity was overt and direct. That happened during the Shifter War of 1967-1969. Then, we ably and successfully, as a country, demonstrated our resolution and steadfastness in the commitment to safeguard and protect our ter territorial integrity. We remain resolute and steadfast in the same commitment today. It is important for every Kenyan to understand that threats to territorial integrity are now no longer necessarily overt or direct. The filing of a case against Kenya at the court and the court's assumption of jurisdiction where it, where it had none, are demonstrative of new tactics of using pseudo-judicial processes to undermine territorial integrity. For these reasons, and in addition to withdrawing its participation from the current case, Kenya, on the 24th September 2021, also joined many other members of the United Nations in withdrawing its recognition of the court's compulsory jurisdiction. As a sovereign nation, Kenya shall no longer be subject to an international court or, tri or tribunal without its expressed consent. The government of Kenya recognizes and has consistently indicated as much that the judgment of the court whichever way it decides, will have profound security, political, social, and economic ramifications in our region and beyond. This will undoubtedly be unfortunate in a region that is already under the torment of terrorism, instability, and conflict. 